great French port of Brest, after 46 days of fighting, finally falls to United States troops. Surrender of the Nazi garrison is accepted by General Robertson, commanding the 2nd Infantry Division. Leading his dog, General Ramke, German commandant at Brest, gives himself up. Prisoners are marched off to detention camps. By holding out here at Brest, as in every French port, the Germans gained time for their retreat to the Siegfried Line, but they were foredoomed to failure. Brest was the home base of undersea fleets that once terrorized Atlantic shipping. Now these huge U-boat pens are lost to the Germans. The port of Brest, with the largest anchorage in Europe, was heavily damaged by the fury of battle.